So basically, when you go to an eye doctor with a modern setup, first you will meet the optometrist who will do a refraction or check your eye power. Then they will also check the pressure of the eye. This is a very important component of an eye examination and should never be missed. Even if you go to an optometrist, they should also check your eye power. Abroad, when you go to an optometrist to check your eye power, they will not simply check your eye power, they will also take a look inside the eye and check your eye pressure. So in India, usually it's the ophthalmologist or the eye doctor who does this job. We get the eye number checked, we get the eye pressure checked. Then you sit in front of a machine called a OCT. This is a coherence tomography, something like a CT scan of the eye. It uses the laser beam and creates an optical or a laser cross section of the eye and a computer generates an image. So this tells us, is there anything wrong in the layers of the eye? After that, you come in to see me or any other eye doctor. So this is basic eye checkup. Once I determine that something is wrong with the eye, I will then send you for further tests. The different tests we do, and there are many of them, can be perimetry or checking the field of vision in glaucoma patients or in patients with nerve disease. Also, the different tests we can do is an IOL master or checking the lens power. How do we determine what lens is implanted in the eye after a cataract surgery? So these measurements are given by a machine called an IOL master. In case you have come to the eye doctor to ask, can I remove my spectacles? We also do a test called pachymetry where we measure the thickness of the cornea and also the corneal shape in a test called corneal topography. As the name suggests, topography creates a map of the eye, just like if you look at the map of the earth, you can see where the rivers are and where the elevated regions are. Similarly, topography will look at the cornea and will tell us, are there any irregular bumps or bulges on the surface of the eye, which will make you ineligible for laser eye surgery.